We are gathered here today to celebrate the love and commitment of two incredible souls, Montana and Ryan. Welcome to your wedding celebration! You were joined by destiny many, many years ago, and this love has blossomed and endured, making you both an inspiration to us all. Today marks the beginning of the newest chapter in your lives. From the moment you met in high school, your love continues to grow into something truly extraordinary. Your journey has been filled with adventure, laughter, the gym, and shared passions. Today we celebrate your commitment to each other and this love that binds you. Ryan, do you promise to keep Montana as your favorite person? To laugh with her? to go on adventures with her, to support her throughout life's challenges. Do you promise to cherish her, to grow old with her? And most importantly, do you promise to continue to find new reasons to love her every single day? I do. Montana, do you promise to keep Ryan as your favorite person, to laugh with him, to go on adventures with him, and to support him through life's toughest moments? Do you promise to cherish him, to grow old with him, and to continue to find new reasons to love him every day? I do. At this time, Ryan, please share your vows with Montana. I wrote a book. Ugh. Do you know what happened to my heart? <laughs> well, let me tell you. My love, I didn't fall in love with the thought of you. I fell in love because you make me feel worth it every single day. You light me up when I'm sad. You calm me when I'm mad. And you comfort me when I'm just going through it. You're the light of my life. Six years ago, it took me one night to say yes. I think you remember that night? Sitting on the bench, overlooking the water with that shooting star in the sky. I wanted to believe I was just lucky for once that things just went my way that night. But honestly, I'm proud to say that finding you wasn't luck. It was love. I fell in love with you because even when I make mistakes, have hardships, or when I have my lows, you choose to stay. I fell in love with you because you wanted nothing but the person I am. You make me feel like I'm not alone. When I look at you, all I see is perfection. I see it in your eyes. I can feel it on your skin. And I can taste it on your lips. <laughs> you give me unconditional love. And no, we don't come from the best example of that, but that's what makes you different than anybody. You don't follow the lead. You don't follow, you lead, and I'm here to learn. You've taught me so many things in our relationship, but how to love, that feeling you give me of love is a feeling words can't describe. You've taught me how to be strong, watching you go through. Watching you go through your lows and how you overcome your adversity. You go through is admirable. I live by action. That action speaks louder than words, so I promise to be your side through all things life throws at you. And show you every day how thankful I am to wake up next to you and be the one to kiss you. Good morning. I wanna leave with this. Do you remember sitting on the bench, 
at the lake and we were 17 years old and we signed that promise contract. <laughs> Ew. We were corny. We were corny. But I'm going to read some of them. I promise to always be honest. I promise to always communicate. I promise to never let anything come in between us. I promise to love and accept you for you. Well, I want to add one more promise to that contract. I promise to give you that unconditional love you give me for the rest of my life. And when we grow old and wrinkly together, I'll cherish every moment we spend together because our love is once in a lifetime. I love you, Montana. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. <clears throat> I knew the day would come that I'd have to try and write about my endless love for you. For the past six years, we created the kind of love that some people would never get to experience. When I met you at 17, I was a lost, broken high school girl, and I never thought. And I, and I never knew the impact you would have on my life. God knew exactly what I needed, and that was you. You made me a better me. You've allowed me to grow into the woman I always wanted to be. You've accepted and believed in me no matter what that looked like, and you healed me. You made me believe that love was possible and that I'm worth being loved endlessly. You're the most genuine, protecting, loving man, and there's nothing that I've ever wanted more than a man like you. Some people call what we have true love, but our love is the purest form of love. An indescribable, unconditional love. We've never given the option to not choose each other. During all the ups and downs, the heartbreaks, the challenges, the tests, it only made us stronger. Thank you for loving me when times are hard, for having my back because you know my heart's too big, for being there when I really needed you, and mostly, thank you for never giving up on us. I look at you every single day and wonder how I got so lucky to be loved by you. A man with confidence, compassion, strength, and, sorry. You're good, you're good, you're good. Strength, ambition, loyalty, and a big soft heart at the core. <laughs> you're everything my young self could have wanted in a husband and someone I hope every day I could be half of the person you've become. I vow endless love. I vow to continue to be there when life throws us, the tough, throws us the toughest battles. I vow to be the best wife I could possibly be for you. I will be the 100% when you aren't able to be. I vow to take care of you and to prioritize us always. I vow faithfulness, happiness, patience, and understanding. I vow to always, I vow to always make you feel seen and heard. I vow to be your best friend and laugh with you until our faces hurt, to soak up every new chapter together as we grow up. And I vow to be the best mother to our future family and be the best example of love for them that we never got to see. You still make me feel those butterflies I felt back in high school, just like when we saw the shooting star. I always knew you were my soulmate. I will find you in every lifetime because our love story is too infinite to just be enough for this one. I love you so much, my love, and I'll always say I do. Congratulations.
Brian, please take Montana's ring in your hand. And Montana, please take Brian's ring in yours. Brian, at this time, please place the ring on Montana's finger and then repeat after me. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a symbol. As a symbol. Of my love and commitment. Of my love and commitment. With this ring. With this ring. I promise. I promise. To be your confidant. To be your confidant. Your rock. Your rock. And your greatest supporter. And your greatest supporter. I promise to love you. I promise to love you. For all the days of our lives. For all the days of our lives. Give you this ring as a symbol as a symbol of my love and commitment of my love and commitment with this ring with this ring i promise i promise to be your confidant to be your confidant your rock your rock and your greatest supporter and your greatest supporter i promise to love you i promise to love you <laughs> for all the days of our lives for all the days of our lives And now, for the moment you've all been waiting for, <laughs> by the power that is entrusted in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Brian, please kiss your wife. <laughs> great pleasure that I present to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Kayud. Yeah.